Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2021 Panini Illusions Football. Eight box, half case, pick your team number four. All card ship. A lot of nice stuff in here. This is my first live look at it. Jason's been doing most of these. But thank you everyone for spending a bit of your Thursday night with us and getting this football break done. No fillers either, just got it knocked out all straight out. There's Steve with the last spot mojo, Buccaneers. There is another case. Half case, fresh case up on the site right now if you're watching live, jazbeescasebreaks.com. Jason marked all those four. You can see all those numbers right there. So you know that they're all from the same case. Three autograph, two memorabilia cards per box on average. Good luck, boys and girls. Igor was saying, kind of out of context, but he was saying that will definitely help Matt Ryan's case, needing one more TD to pass Peyton Manning for ninth all time. Yeah, that's going to be an interesting debate. Is Matt Ryan a Hall of Famer? He's got the... Uh, I guess he has the, a lot of the counting stats are definitely there, but no. An elusive, uh, has he won an MVP? Maybe, the, has an MVP eluded him? Maybe a, a Super Bowl win would have been a nice, nice addition to his resume, but we'll see. Harry, what's up? Good to be back. Happy holidays. Trey Sermon to three ninety nine. There's Dan Marino to two ninety nine. Tillon Wallace to four ninety nine. And we've got an Illusions rookie card, Trevor Lawrence. It's for the Jaguars, Jason Kirsch with the Jags. And we got Ian Book and Drew Brees, dual relic, rookie idols. Rough day at the office for, for Ian Book. And that will be for Larry and the Saints. Chris Godwin, autograph, 79 out of 99. Limelight signatures, that's pretty cool. Top loaders. Hang on a second. All right, so the Chris Godwin is for Steve Birch, last spot mojo. That was the card that, that you were looking for, nice. <laughs> yeah, right, Rex? But I feel I feel like the, the LeBron might have gone for more, but I suppose that the 50 auto book is more of a spectacle. Michael's first break Michael Swartz's first break was when I pulled the LeBron logo, man. You're, yeah, good memory, Michael. Yeah, I think someone had a, someone won that in a random number block. Here's Justin Fields, Bears, Francis. And a dual relic, dual auto, Nico Collins and Davis Mills. 
who has actually been, been slinging the football pretty well these days. In fact, the Texans have actually not looked too bad in the last few weeks. So that uh, goes to Nathaniel Smith. There you go, Nate. Dual Relic, Trey Sermon, Ricky Waters. That's Jay Graggs with San Francisco. There's Rogers, Jones, there's Trey Lance, there's Zach Wilson. 88 out of 249 for the Jets. That's going to go to Adam and his Jets. I like that parallel. Looked good last week. Trey Lance might get an opportunity this week to make something happen. That'll be for Greggs and the Niners. Pat Fryermuth. Another autograph, 12 out of 75 for the Steelers. Ink blots autograph. That's going to go to Nick and the Steelers. Chase Claypool to 499. And a King of Cards pink parallel, Trevor Lawrence. Another one for the Jaguars, Jason. That is 68 out of 399. Hopefully, uh, he'll start getting on track. All right, next box. Yeah, the, the LeBron logo, man, got you to come to Jaspies? Yeah, that was a pretty nice hit. Pretty, pretty nice. Yeah, that Immaculate Basketball, we pulled a, a lot of nice stuff out of that Immaculate Basketball. And we do have pre-orders for that on jazbeescasebreaks.com for the next edition of Immaculate Basketball. And hopefully, we'll work through all those cases and, and we can start, you know, telling some new stories about some of the new logo mans that we that we hit. Next box, we got a Ramondre Stevenson, Curtis Martin, Deja Vu, dual relic, 2 out of 10. It's pretty nice. That'll be for Jeremy H. and the Patriots. Got another Trevor Lawrence, King of Cards. Be, I don't know how many parallels are of these, but that would be a cool rainbow to build. Jaguars, Jason. Devontae Smith to 499. And we've got rookie autograph, Jacob Harris. 99 out of 99 rookie enshrinements for the Rams. That would be Jerry Bennington with the Rams. Two out well, four out of ten. Nice low number here for the Rams. It'll be for Jerry. Jonathan Taylor limelight signatures. Nice, thirty-five out of one ninety-nine. 
what a season he's been having. An outside chance for MVP, maybe? That'll be for Harry and the Colts. I'm terrified, Harry, of Jonathan Taylor and what he might do to the Raiders' defense this weekend. I think Ra I'm pretty sure Raiders can, my Raiders control their own destiny. So if they can beat the Colts on the road this weekend and then the Chargers the following weekend, then they're in the playoffs. I'm a little conflicted. They're not a very good team, my Raiders. Do I want to see them in getting blown out in the playoffs? Or am I happy that they've just made the playoffs? I don't know. There's a lot of conflicting emotions there. But my first impressions, Relic and Otter, Kadarius Tony, 169 out of 299. That Colts matchup is going to be tough. Giants, that'll be for Brian Watford. And I also feel like... Uh, I also feel like Jonathan Taylor had kind of a, uh, a quieter week last week than, than usual anyway. I think he had a good game, but quieter than usual. So does that mean he has a huge week this week? And we got Justin Jefferson highlight swatches. For the Vikings, that's going to go to Nicholas Wheat in Minnesota. What, only 108 yards for, for Jonathan Taylor? So, so that definitely means he's rushing for, what, 180 yards and three touchdowns against my Raiders? All right, next box. Michael Stewart saying he needs like 200 yards each of the next two games to hit 2,000. Might break that record against the Raiders. Although well, Raiders, Raiders have been playing some gutsy football. And I don't know if it's going to be enough against a team like the uh, like the Colts. We'll see. Right, he didn't have a TD last week, so right. That means like four against my Raiders this week. Is this game live? Washington, Arizona State. All right. Hey, speaking of the Broncos, 37 out of 75. There's Jerry Judy. I saw the uh, Raiders Broncos uh, on the 26th. It was just this past Sunday. It was great to my first Raiders game. First game at the uh, at the stadium, the brand new stadium. Allegiant looked fantastic, so it was definitely a good time. There's Austin Eckler to 25 autograph, illusionists autograph for Patrick and the Chargers. I think he's on the mend from from COVID, but definitely did not help my fantasy team last weekend. But I think he's getting back into to health. Ramondre Stevenson, first impressions, jersey and auto. 53 out of 75. Patriots, that'll be for Jeremy H. We got a Zach Wilson, clear visions, clear shots. Mac Jones for the Patriots, so 149. So that'll be for Jeremy H. and the Pats. And the Zach Wilson will go to Adam and his Jets.
Sean Taylor to 399. Devonta Smith, Kadarius Tony, D Hop, and we got a Jalen Waddle and Jarvis Landry for the Dolphins. Jalen Waddle looking really good. Dolphins, that's going to go to Jeremy H. We got a Matt Ryan to 249. King of Cards, Joe Montana to 399. Stafford. And a semi uh, Feoco. Rookie autographs for the Cowboys. That's going to go to Jesse and, the, and, uh, and Dallas. Who's the pick for Offensive Rookie of the Year? Jonathan Taylor to 399. Jalen Waddell? I think some, we were talking about this last week. I want to say that Mac Jones, at least Vegas has Mac Jones as your leading offensive rookie of the year. But that'd be interesting to see. I'd love to see like a, I mean, usually it feels like it's a quarterback award, right? But yeah, I'd like to see Jamar Chase or Jalen Waddle or Najee Harris get a, you know, a non-quarterback to get a look at the rookie of the year. I think that'd be nice. Yeah, King's thinking Najee Harris is offensive rookie of the year. That'd be good for the hobby. I think Jamar Chase was kind of running away with it, but then I think defense has kind of started putting some more attention on him, so... He has us to kind of adjust for that. So he had a couple, two or three down games, I want to say. Jalen Waddle has been, I think, coming back from some injury. But he had a great game uh, this past week. I think Najee Harris has been pretty steady throughout the season. So it'll be interesting to see what uh, what the off who the offensive rookie of the year is going to be. Kyle Pitts, it's an impact relic for the Falcons. That'll be for Brody. All right, Micah Parsons could be could have a shot at Defensive Player of the Year. That's for sure. And there's Miles Sanders to 499. Mac Jones to 399. Patriots. Jeremy. Justin Fields will go to Francis. Justin's pointing out, hey, LSU's got top three rookie receiving yards in NFL history. Go Tigers. Uh, some sort of Travis Etienne, some sort of wide receiver factory. There's Stefan Diggs. 15 out of 25. Nice autograph there for the Bills. Jeffrey Mason. Buffalo! Tebow. And a nice looking Keenan Allen, 33 out of 50, cracked ice. Wow, that looks really sharp. That'll be for the Chargers, that's gonna go to Patrick. The 
Here's Ian Book, jersey and autograph. First impressions, first impressions, a little rough. A rough day at the office for him. 172 out of 299. But let's not close the book on him just yet. Saints. Larry with the Saints. No way it's Diggs, says Harry. Zach Wilson's are for Adam. I mean, Diggs might just win Defensive Player of the Year, and Parsons might win Rookie, Defensive Rookie of the Year. So that, I mean, that'd be a nice feather in the cap for, um, for that Cowboys defense. There's Rashad Bateman, 14 out of 75. Instant impact, three color patch. That'll be for Aaron and the Baltimore Ravens. 14 out of 75. You think Parsons is going to win both? When's the last time a rookie has won the... When's the last time a rookie has won the the rookie of the year, the offense or defensive rookie of the year, and player of the year? How often does that happen? I feel like it doesn't. All right, halfway through this half case break, about another 20 minutes to go. Or so. And Nate is reporting that we're we're down to six teams left on Spectra football. So we can get some uh, we can get some more NFL going after this. What else is selling out? That mosaic basketball fast break we can do. The rest of the rest of the things are pre orders. We can do more of those mini helmets. Maybe more illusions, we can run back another illusions break. And after we sell out uh, Spectra, pick your team seven, which again, Nate's saying only seven, uh, six teams left, I'll post two box break number eight, and that's the last two boxes of the case that we've been working on, two boxes at a time. Justin saying Notre Dame QBs have gone 0 and 24 in their last 24 starts. Who are who are those who are those quarterbacks? I mean, Book is one of them, right? He was from, he's at Notre Dame. Another Trevor Lawrence. Devonta Smith, Zach Wilson, and a Trevor Lawrence red ink autograph. 46 out of 50. Jacksonville Jaguars, Jason Kirsch picked up the Jags straight up. Nice. Tannehill to 499. And Kyle Pitts, Tony Gonzalez. Dual relic. 41 out of 75. That's, an, that's a great duo there, Brody. And we got a Justin Fields highlight swatches. 7 out of 99. Francis and the Bears. Is it Clausen and Kaiser? Kaiser was 0-15 as an NFL star. And a redemption. Justin Fields to 249, Bears. 
Francis. There you go, Brody. Hopefully, if Kyle Pitts can turn out to be a Tony Gonzalez, that'd be pretty nice. Trey Lance to 399. King of Cards, Acetate. Daniel Jones. Uh, and Phil Sims in the background there to 25. And Elusive Inc. Hardy Nickerson. There's uh, 69 out of 199 for the Buccaneers. C. Birch. Ouch. So here are your, your 0 for Notre Dame quarterbacks. Brady Quinn, 0 for 4. Jimmy Clausen, 0 for 4. Kaiser, Deshaun Kaiser, I think, 0 for 15. Ian Book, 0 for 1. And Justin Fields for the Bears. Prove me saying all I know is that someone in the Ravens needs to be fired for letting Judon go. Nick Chubb, 25, and there's Jalen Waddle to 149. Your redemption is Kyle Pitt. There you go, Brody. First impressions autograph memorabilia for the ATL. Three boxes to go. What happens with Russell Wilson? There's Jerry Judy, 25 out of 25, trophy collection. Jerry Judy and Emmanuel Sanders. And Javante Williams, teammate. 53 out of 99 for my rival, Sam, with the Denver Broncos. Got Justin Fields, Instant Impact Relic for Da Bears, Francis. Not numbered. Mystique, insert, Zach Wilson. This one is numbered, 299, Adam. What a game for Joe Burrow the other day. Trey Lance autograph. I think we might see Trey Lance in action this weekend, right, for the Niners? I think Jimmy Garoppolo is going to be able to do it. He's got some, some hand injuries, I want to say. 22 out of 35, Trey Lance for the Niners. Jay Grags. Darren Waller, Raiders need to get him back healthy soon. If they want to shock the world against teams like that. Sean Taylor to 249. Justin Fields to 399. Clear shots. Francis with the Bears. And we've got Elusive Inc. 58 out of 75. Derek Mason, old oiler. 
It goes to the Titans, of course. That'll be for Patrick Davis. I like the design on this, this illusions. It's pretty fun. Josh Allen, illusionists, Zach Wilson. Another redemption, and we've got a 9 out of 50. Peyton Manning, king of cards. Deshaun Watson to 499. More Trey Lance, clear shots. Zach Wilson, 10 out of 99, and Davis Mills. Sort of ruby red color looks really nice against the green. Redemption is Najee Harris. First impressions, autograph, memorabilia. We were just talking about how he could potentially be an offensive rookie of the year candidate. He's a little bit of a longer shot, but he's had a pretty solid season. Nick T with Pittsburgh. Sounding like, like Ben Rothberger might be hanging up the cleats at the end of the season. All right, two more boxes to go. You know, that, uh, that game at Allegiant was pretty nice. The pregame show, Dion Warwick came out and saying what the world needs now was great. You know who did the Star Spangled Banner National Anthem? Montel Jordan. This is how we do it. Montel Jordan did the National Anthem. It was pretty great. Michael Buffer did his thing there too. Raiders won. That was nice. All right, onward. We got Jonathan Taylor to 249. There's Najee Harris to 399. And Devonta Smith, autograph. There you go, Jenna. Jenna helped out. Jenna was, she was just like, come on, Eagles, go sports. And there it is for the Fly Eagles Fly and Logan M. 64 out of 125, Devonta Smith, the exciting playmaker. For the fly, Eagles fly, on the road to something, 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 something. And then you spell out Eagles and fight. That's exactly how the song goes. We got old Herbie, Justin Herbert. Highlight relic for the bolt. That's going to go to Patrick. Zach Wilson, Steve Young, one of one, but a randomizer. Oh no. Oh no. This is one happy person, one sad person. Zach Wilson, Jets, Adam Kupperman. Steve Young, Niners, Jay Greggs. One person very happy, one person very sad. We'll do that randomizer at the end. Fingers crossed for both of you. There's Elusive Inc., Patrick Sertain. For the Dolphins, Patrick Sertain Sr., 86 out of 199. Miami, that'll be for Jeremy. I meant no disrespect, Harry. I was doing my best to sing this, this, the fight song. I don't know it.
Raiders, we don't have a we don't have a song. We should have a song. There's Mac Jones to 149. The Trey Lance. Although at the Raiders Stadium at Allegiant, they would uh they would often play the the autumn and the autumn wind is a Raiders song. Return of the Mac. Mac Jones for Jeremy. Trey Sermon, jersey and autograph. 104 out of 299. Jay Graggs. Anthony Schwartz to 149. Raiders song is all gunshot. Actually, no, we're more of a... Raiders, we're more of a stabbing bunch. There's Tillon Wallace at 399, so... So I don't... I think that's an unfair stereotype, Harry. All right, final box. All right, next. Final box, and then that randomizer. That's going to make one person really happy and one person really sad. There's Devonta Smith, 399. We got uh, 57.99 superlatives. Christian Kirksey. What's the superlative? He's the best. That goes to Nate. J.K. Dobbins, Justin Fields, and we've got a first impressions jersey and autograph for Adam and the Jets, 43 out of 99. I, got, I have a feeling the boat, now, now with this hit right here, I feel like the, the Jets and the Niners have both had some pretty pretty nice hits individually. So maybe that one of one will be more of a cherry on top as opposed to, hey, I need this hit to make my break. It's Joe Burrow to, four, to 149. You got Lights Camara action to 99. Lamar Jackson to 399. And we've got rookie signs, Nick Bolton for the Chiefs. That's Harry with Kansas City. Sam Darnold to 499. We got a Simi Fioco, instant impact relic for Dallas. That's going to go to Jesse. There's the Mystique Trevor Lawrence, a lot of Jaguars, a lot of Lawrence cards, all of this will add up. Rashad Bateman, Trey Lance. We got for Jay Graggs, we got more Niners for you, Jay Graggs. We've got a Trey Sermon, Ricky Waters dual relic. Man, if Trey Sermon ended up like Ricky Waters, I don't think Niners fans would not complain about that. I don't think that's numbered, but nice dual relic. Good pairing there. Justin Fields, clear shots. 
is your last acetate card. And now one person happy, one person sad. This is going to be a rough one. All right, let's get some new dice. Let's flip back over the, to the ram.org screen. I just need one blank list. New York Jets, San Francisco 49ers. Good luck. Let's roll it, randomize that list. Snake Eyes, two times, team on top after two. Good luck, one and two. After two times, goes to the Jets, New York Jets on top. That goes to Adam Kupperman and his Jets. He's a big Jets fan. One of one, you got the Zach Wilson NFL Shield and the Mitchell and Ness tag for Steve Young. That's pretty nice. There you go, hey. Adam, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with us, everybody. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. We do have some more illusions up on the site. Um, half case from a fresh case, jazbeescasebreaks.com. I'm Joe. I'll see you next time for that football break. Bye-bye.